Hey guys, this is Roller Derby Mark Roman. Want to send you guys another video of my Roller Derby collection. Um, and I hope everybody in the YouTube community, uh, community is doing well despite all of this, you know, coronavirus stuff. But um, anyways, enough about that. Let's get into this video. Um, I am showing all of my Roller Derby pennants that I have. So this one is a Red Devils one. This is from, I uh, believe, the 1950s or so, or 60s. Look at that, really nice. Those guys there doing the crossovers. <laughs> it's a really nice pennant. It says Roller, it says Roller Derby and then Red Devils. Alright, now I'm going to just put each pennant on top of each other. Other one here, this one, same thing. Got the two guys doing the five stride. It's from the 1950s. Um, it's a more darker red, um, which I really think uh, like. It's really, really cool. And this one says Brooklyn Red Devils. Really stands out. I like that Brooklyn Red Devils font how like how 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 the bee is big <clears throat> but yep truly nice one guys next one this is a bay bomber one from the thinking the mid 60s early 70s right there's Joan Weston on the front there, it's one of number 38. Bombers. Nice orange with black bombers right here. Really nice. <clears throat> I'm going to just put these over here. Okay, here's another one. This is from the... Has to be either from the 40s or the 50s, just judging from the way this is. You know, the way the style is and everything. There's a young woman flying across the United States, I guess. Whatever. Looks nice. Yeah, each one just says roller derby. It's really nice felt, too. So, yeah, that was really nice. <clears throat> Once again, the two guys doing the fives, they're doing the crossovers. This is dark blue. The blue tassels here. And these are the Chiefs. A little bit, lettering's a little cracked from age. Other than that, it's a really nice one, huh, guys? Yeah. Alright. Here is. Another one, Roller Derby. This is like so 1950s right here. Um, the, this is burgundy-ish color, I guess. It's of the Braves. So, really nice. <clears throat> This one's a colorful one. It looks like he's in space. <laughs> but this is a Roller Games one right here from uh has to be from the set I would have to say the 70s, early 70s. Um right here Renegades. Some dark blue felt right here with the red right here yeah this is from roller games <clears throat> all right there's a spaceman again <laughs> roller games and this is this is the outlaws 
So this has to be the 60s. These outlaws came out in the mid 60s. So dark red, black. Yep. <clears throat> Here is a LA Thunderbirds one from 1970. The Thunderbirds logo right here. And this is a World Championship Thunderbirds pennant. I like the the blue right here. I like how it says LA and then big blue lettering Thunderbirds I like also too how it says 1970 world champions it's really it's a really nice one I really like this one all right <clears throat> <clears throat> this one here is really nice too this is um, these were given out right before the Shea Stadium game and during the Shea Stadium game in 1973 where they had the, um, they had a double header um, and there was a, a four-man coach match race. Um, the coaches that were from these teams, um, it was Bill Grohl, um, you had Ronnie Robinson, um, you had Charlie O'Connell, and for the Jolters, it was Cal Stevens, and I have pictures from that Shea Stadium game in color. I have a bunch of pictures of that match race. No, excuse me. Um, well, yeah, it was. Um, it was a coach's match race, and um, I think Cal Stevens won, if I'm not too mistaken. But, yeah, it was Charlie O'Connell on the Bombers, um, Bill Grohl on the Chiefs, Ronnie Robinson on the Pioneers and Cal Stevens. And they were all doing a match race during halftime. It was a four man one. So I so wish that there was video footage, but there's not. Because all the games were taped over. <clears throat> but this is from 1873. This is one of my favorite ones. I love all the logos here of each team. You have the Jolters, the Thunderbolt with. The clouds, you have the Chiefs right here. You have the um this is the Pioneers wagon right here. Really cool, and of course the Bay Bombers bomb. Right here it says roller derby. And here are the names Chiefs, Pioneers, Bombers, Jolters on this one. And these are really, really rare too, <clears throat> because these were only sold during that game that happened. And um, from what I was told, like a few weeks prior. And some of them, um, there are some out there that look just like this. But on the top here, it says 1973 Shea Stadium. Um, uh, something like uh, something like, like that. Uh, but it does say like Shea Stadium, but I think it says championship like right here. <clears throat> but this one doesn't have it, but that's cool. I don't mind as long, you know, I mean, just to have this pennant um, with the four uh, uh, roller derby team logos and their, you know, and the team names here is really nice. So it's one of my favorite ones. Alright, here's a rare one too. This is a Chiefs pennant from Madison Square Garden. You saw it right. I love this logo. I love it. It's big. It's bold. It really stands out. It's super cool. Um, right there, Chiefs. And it's funny because it has the, has the uh, comma here or the apostrophe I didn't want to call it and usually the Chiefs the Chiefs um, name it never had that so I thought that was in interesting <clears throat> excuse me but yep yeah, this one's from Mountain Square Garden um, has to be from thinking 1972 or 1973 um, so just look at that 
Look at that. Just boom. It's so it just stands out so big. <clears throat> it's really cool. And the last one, another Chiefs one. There's another Chiefs logo right there. Here, there's the Native American right here, Chiefs. And then it says the Chiefs. It's really nice. <clears throat> and this and this is I'm pretty sure this was like 72, 73 as well. I'm almost positive. Yeah, it was. So <clears throat> well, there you have it, guys. Those are all of my pennants that I have. I hope you all enjoyed it. And please um, like this video, leave comments, share it with your friends and family, um, share my page too as well, share my videos all around to your friends and family. And please subscribe to my channel. I would greatly appreciate it. And um, hope everybody enjoys, you know, the history uh, that I share with all of my uh, co collection about the teams and the skaters and, and everything. Um, you know, I really try my best to be very informative, <clears throat> you know. Um, because me coming from parents who both skated professional roller derby, um, my mom Carol Peanuts Meyer and my dad Dynamite Tony Roman, they were on the Bombers, um, and I just do my best to preserve roller derby, to quote unquote, to uh, you know just to keep it alive and and just to share with uh, fans around the world um, um, about this amazing sport that just dominated the world 